Brighton Coffee Company in York and Adams County is celebrating all the nostalgia of the 90s this week with coffee and donut specials, channeling what many millennials, uh, including myself, consider one of the best decades ever. And here to show us some of those radical items, our owner, Jordan Brighton and uh, Jason Hollenbach. Good morning, guys. We love coffee. We run on coffee here yeah. on the morning show. So this is so cool. Thanks for coming in. Yeah, absolutely. Happy so to be here. We're going to show you guys how to make our Blockbuster cold foam. I don't know if you guys uh, remember being nine, Do ten we years remember. old. Do we remember? And, you know, <laughs> dad picking you up and mm -hmm. going and grabbing pizza and grabbing a movie. And so this is inspired by that. Uh, Jason, you want to just tell us what it is we're making here? Yeah, so we're starting with our caramel flavoring, which we're going to add our dairy to. That's going to give you that yellow bottom, you know, reminiscent of uh, the butter that's going to go on top of our popcorn, yeah. but also <laughs> that Blockbuster logo. Uh, then we'll add our ice. And coffee to the top, Jordan, if you want to add some of that coffee there. Yes, I will. And then this is kind of the key to the drink. It is our toffee nut blue cold foam. So what we've done is we've added toffee nut, heavy cream in 2%. Then we're going to blend that up to make a thick, frothy, real tasty cold foam. I love, I love the idea behind it. I want to talk about the idea, but first tell us about the coffee shop that you guys have. Sure, yeah, so we uh, started in a horse trailer, which we renovated. Uh, in order to start a business, you need money, and I had... Thanks, man. <laughs> As you can tell, making the cold foam every now and again can get a bit loud. And yeah, we had no money, and we basically said, let's just find a way to do this really cheap, and we did a drive through coffee trailer, and now, three years later, we've got... Uh, this is our third shop just opened, so... Yeah, and we make our house-made donuts, which we've got out here as well. And these um, are also 90s inspired as well. Uh, I don't right. know if you can see this one, reminiscent of um, Dunkaroos yes. there. Yeah. Love that. I think what the other one is Nerds, yes. too. Yes, yes. So there you go. That is, so, okay, we got to talk about it. I'm yeah. a 90s baby. I still live in the 90s. I'm still listening to mixed CDs in my car. 100%. At least they're not cassettes. <laughs> but um, let's talk about why are you doing this 90s kind of theme right now. Yeah, I just think the world could use a little bit of like throwback and just like, I don't know, life seems simpler in the 90s to me. Mm -hmm. And so we were like, what can we do just to kind of give people, especially as it gets warmer out, people are kind of coming out of hibernation. We're like, how can we just make this fun for our, our people? And we do new specials every two weeks. We actually do 26 sets of specials a year. So we're regularly changing things out and we need uh, lots of ideas. Lots and of, so, so yeah. we went back to the 90s, yeah, throw it back. It. And it's very Instagram worthy as well. Yes. All right. So, um, what was the favorite movie at Blockbuster that you guys would run? If we're, if we're, if we're going to talk about the Blockbuster Cold Brew, right? It's it's an easy one for me. It's kind of cheesy, but The Princess Bride is my good. <laughs> <laughs> it's, my heart. it's like this. It brings me back to better times. You know, staying sick home, watching that movie. So that's that's my good. There you yeah. go. I just really love how how uh, you know Blockbuster is kind of just like the whole experience. Like mm -hmm. you didn't know what you were going to get. Now it's so you get any movie you want right. is at your fingertips. But there you had to go. You had to look and look through the movies. Was it in stock? Right. You know, there were so right. many questions. Whatever you got, you went home. So, yeah, I love it that you're bringing it back and kind of just, like, reminding us of simpler times. That yeah. experience of walking around with your family is re very reminiscent of our shops. We're very family-focused and fun. We always have kid play elements at all of our shops, whether it's a custom horse trailer they can make coffee out of or a storefront facade in another one of our shops. All right, so you made it for us. We're going to try it. Not yet, though. We're going to send it back um, to Andrea. She's going to do a quick check on weather. Andrew, we're going to wait for you to try the coffee and the donuts because I also want to talk about a podcast that you guys saw. Yeah, sure. so, yeah, don't go anywhere. Uh, so kind of you guys. Thank you so much. I can't